Listen, I am doing this video as an inspiration. The channel that I made a whole lot of money on was subsequently deleted. But I am inspired by this video because I know that I can do it all over again. But let's talk about it. The endless possibilities to make good money on YouTube with a little effort ingenuity and dedication beautiful babes have you ever wondered i mean really wondered how much youtube pays for millions of views well today i'm excited to share some information about my own personal channel i actually started youtube long before then so the channel this video is based around was actually deleted in December 2023, removed by YouTube. And we'll be talking about that in a future video. That particular channel was started in 2014. Yes, a long time. So I've been around the block a long time when it comes to these YouTube streets. But let's dive back into the video. However, because I didn't know much about it, I had all kind of things going on that I didn't need to have going on. And I had to, you know, delete those channels and rehash. OK, hence we are here on this channel today. But back to these coins. So today I'm going to deep dive into my own YouTube channel, into the world of YouTube earnings and uncover some truths behind those mesmerizing numbers you're going to want to stick around for this honestly money, money. beautiful babes welcome back to my channel if you are a returning subscriber welcome in if you are new and nosy come on in i'm glad to have you hanging out with me today honestly speaking okay now, y'all know one thing about my channel. If you've been here for a minute, you know I believe in transparency and sharing insights, how to's, what do's with the amazing community that you all have helped me to build on this channel. You all have seen me at my best and you have seen me at my worst. But in this video today, I'm going to pull back the curtain and reveal exactly how much YouTube paid me for a video that I have right here that got 4 million views, currently over 4 million views, yes. But before I jump into that, I really think I should explain or give some quick dirty details about what actually influences YouTube payments. But before I dive right into all of the details, let me just quickly explain that YouTube payments are influenced by various factors. It's not just about the view count, but also about engagement, ad revenue, and other key elements. So the amount of money that I personally made on my video that got 4 million views can vary significantly on those factors and other variables. We're talking about the average watch time, ad click-through rates, and the type of ads shown, skippable versus non-skippable, display ads, etc. And additionally, YouTube's monetization policies and algorithms are subject to change over time, which can further impact earnings. So as a YouTube content creator, you have access to what they call the YouTube's Creator Studio. You can get a better estimate of potential earnings if you refer to the studio. It's going to provide analytics and monetization information specific to your channel or in my case, my channel. It's important to note that YouTube payments are typically not based solely on views, but rather on the generated revenue from ads associated with those views. And also let me just let you know, I want to explore how your location, audience demographics, and the types of ads displayed can impact 
earnings. But one thing I want you to keep in mind is that it is a dynamic process that can differ for each creator. Now, I know what you came here for, and I'm going to share that with you momentarily. So stay tuned for the big reveal as I share my personal experience and shed some light on the reality of earning money from 4 million views on YouTube. Get ready for the truth. Now, before we get into that, before we embark on this eye-opening adventure and discover the secrets of YouTube earnings, I need y'all to do me a favor. Please go ahead, hit the subscribe button, and turn on your notification bell because you won't want to miss what's coming up next. So I fell into the world of YouTube again, 2014. I'll just mark that date. I was actually introduced fully to YouTube by my youngest daughter. Her name is Maddie, and she also has a YouTube channel, Maddie's Glam Life. Go check her out. So I don't want to deviate, but let's get back to these numbers, okay? But she introduced me to YouTube back in the day, and I had no idea what I was getting into and had no idea I would still be hanging around doing these videos today. But that is where it started from. I found my niche, which I love natural treatments. I love beauty. I love all things beauty. I love womanhood, what's going on with us girls, different things from A to Z. Y'all already know. If you're over here, you're going to find just a little bit of a mix of what goes on with your girl. So did I really think I could get on here and make money? Uh, I really didn't. I was doing it because I love doing YouTube videos. I was already in the entertainment business. As you know, I'm a soul blues singer, saxophonist, and I just love the idea of coming on this camera. I just want to tell you a little bit of story. Back in the day, back in the day, in my college years, I was in college and I wanted to be a news broadcaster. Yes. So being in front of the camera was already something that I, I don't know, had on my platter to do anyway. So this was just perfect for me. Loved the idea. I started off with makeup and things of that nature, but realized that nobody really wanted to see me do my makeup, okay? Which was kind of what my baby girl told me. Mama, don't nobody want to see no old people put on no makeup? Well, <laughs> I had a few. I had a few that loved it. But overall, that was not my niche and not my forte. So I moved on and said, well, let me just do what I do. People would always ask me about my hair, my nails, my hands, my skin, what I do for this, how do I do this? And that's where I had to go ahead and get real and say, well, why not show them? I remember my very first video when I actually came on without makeup, without my hair dolled up, my husband said, You on camera like that? I'm like, Do I look that bad? He said, Well, it's not bad. It's just different. You know, I would assume that you want to show yourself the best. I'm like, No, baby, I got to get real. If this is going to be something that I'm going to do, I got to keep it real. So, sharing my day to day or what I do as far as natural treatments, things that I do around the house for my own personal beauty routines. That's where it stemmed from. And that's how we got to this video right here that has now hit 4 million views. Okay, 4 million views. Did I ever imagine that magnitude? Never, never, but it did. Now, since that time when I initially started YouTube and finally got monetized, monetized meaning that they could run ads on your videos and you could earn money from those ads. It took a while. It took a minute. Right now, they've changed it, whereas in order to get monetized and become a YouTube partner, you must have 1,000 subscribers and get 4,000 watch hours. Sometimes it's a hard stretch to get there, but if you keep posting and keep doing it and remain committed, it does happen. So again, back to, again, the earnings of that particular video. This is what I want to emphasize. I'm being transparent. 
However, I'm not boasting, not bragging. I am personally proud of my accomplishment. I'm excited, but this is not something that you can expect to happen right away. Some people get lucky. Some people have to keep grinding. You know, you have to keep going at it. And the amount of money that I've made on this particular video is not indicative across the board. What you're looking at is for my particular channel. So money earned on a particular video and on my particular video is not representative of all channels as it can vary based on your particular niche, the content and many other factors actually. So now it's time to dive into these numbers. So come on in. I'm going to reveal my actual screen to you so you can check out this video and what did it do and how it did. Okay, let's dive in right now. And as I mentioned, I wanted to be completely transparent with you all. So this video, the Vaseline and Egg video, was actually published on October 5th. 2018. So yes, it's been almost five years. So over time, it's gotten lots of traction throughout these five, almost five years. So let's break out the number that y'all have been waiting for. This is my most viral video ever. I call it viral, even though it did take a few years to build up. However, it is here, y'all. It is right here. So this is my stats on this video. So this is the current 28 days. As you can see, this video is still getting good numbers. 16,138 views in the last 28 days. In the last 28 days, it has earned me an estimated revenue of $74.30. But look at the overall, the views even. You have views here, over 16,000 views, 960 watch hours, and it's gained 232 subscribers. But let's break this out into the real deal. What has it earned since I published it? Again, we're keeping it real. I am going to change the date range here and just show you. Since this video was uploaded, the lifetime of this video, what is the numbers looking like? We're going to click here since uploaded the lifetime of this video. Here we go. Boom. You are here with me. All right. This video has gotten 4,139,791 views since it was uploaded. I know your eyes have already shifted over to right here. Okay. Yes. And this is the revenue that I've earned on this video. 26000 $86.68. Again, when you look at the dollar amount that I've earned for 4 million views, there are things that you do have to consider in the scheme of things, okay? You have to consider, again, the type of ads that are on this video. You have to consider the audience. You have to consider the engagement, how long they watched on this video. And I'll click here on the revenue portion of it to kind of break it down. As you can see, this video again has been out almost five years. So when it first hit, things didn't pop off immediately. This is when it published here. Well, this video was published in October of 2018. Now, when it first hit the ground running, there was not a lot of activity. But one morning, I got up and things start booming. It start booming and booming. Okay. Um, it remained almost consistent for a little bit and then it dipped and then it came back into the cycle of things. This video here is one, as you can see, the daily dollar amounts that's coming through. It is one that has its moments where it just skyrockets and it tapers off and then it skyrocketed again in 2020. Look at these dollar amounts. Oh my God, that peaked out 
what was that? $132? I promise you, $159.36. Oh my word. I'm telling you, you just never know what's going to hit. And this one was one that I I had no idea. I had no idea it was going to be so popular and continues to bring in earnings each and every day for me, which is amazing. And I truly love that. And I am just in awe by this process. Again, breaking out the numbers, what you see, how I made money on this video by watch page ads, $26,000. $86.17. I did get some super chats on here. I earned 51 cents on that. This breaks out all of the details specifically. You get paid for your ads on the video, which this breaks it out even in more detail. $25,997.73. YouTube premium, $88.44. And super thanks of 51 cents. Okay, this has the big factor right here where this money is coming from. Also, the traffic on this particular video. It tells you it'll break out in your YouTube studio where everything is coming from. Suggested videos, on the browse, YouTube search. It breaks it all out for you here. Your geography, who's watching you, where are they from, where is your audience from, will make a difference in your earnings as well because different locales bring different types of dollars, okay? United States, of course, paying the most and it'll divvy out into every other geography area out there. It really is important to know your stats, to know where, you know, your money's coming from, who's watching you, the age range. Of course, y'all know my channel is based upon more mature audience. So my biggest audience is coming right now from 35 to 44 years old. And then the two top other ones is 25 to 34 and the 45 to 54 age range. That is where the age group is coming from. It's definitely amazing to check out these things sometimes when you're going through quite naturally, more females watch my videos than males, okay? And also, we can determine who is subscribed and who's not to the channel. But back to those numbers again, let's get back to where we started at, at the front of it here, with the actual number, $26,086.68. I kid you not. But this is just one of my videos. I do have a few videos that have well over a million views and their estimated earnings are great as well. But this is just to break out the possibilities. Now, if you're still with me, make sure you let me know by dropping a heart down in the comments and let me know how you like this video. I do have a little bit more to cover right now. So let's get into basically what type of videos will give you the most revenue. That is another big factor in who earns more money on YouTube. This is so much fun, y'all. I hope you're enjoying this content as much as I'm enjoying creating it for you today. So while there is no guaranteed formula for high earning videos, there are certain types of content that tend to have the potential to generate more revenue. And I'm just going to give you a few categories and formats that often have the potential to earn higher revenue. First, let's talk about advertiser friendly content. That's that content that aligns with YouTube's advertiser friendly guidelines. That type of content will attract more high paying ads. Now, these guidelines generally emphasize family friendly, non controversial and brand safe. OK, now the other kind is long form and in death videos, longer videos such as tutorials, in depth discussions or documentaries can generate more revenue due to increased watch time and ad placement. However, it's crucial to focus on keeping the content engaging 
and valuable to retain viewers attention. Now next up, I want to put in here educational and how-to videos. Content that provides valuable information, tutorials, educational lessons, or skills training can attract a dedicated audience and higher engagement. This type of content tends to have a longer shelf life, meaning it can continue to generate revenue over an extended period. Now, we do have the niche and specialized content focusing on a specific niche or topic of interest can help attract a dedicated audience and potential advertisers who are looking to reach that particular audience. By becoming an expert in your niche, you can build a loyal following and attract higher paying advertisers. We then have product reviews and recommendations. Creating authentic and informative product reviews, unboxings, or recommendation videos can generate revenue through affiliate marketing or sponsorships. This revenue model involves earning a commission when viewers purchase products through your unique referral links. We'll go into more detail on higher paying videos, what types and how to earn additional money alongside of your ad revenue. We'll get into that in a future video. I didn't want to make this video too long. I just wanted to share the information that I gave you earlier. And you know, there's no foolproof way, but there are ways that are proven that has been successful. And remember, the success and revenue potential of your videos depend on various factors, including the quality of your content, audience engagement, ad placement, viewer demographics, and overall channel performance. Building a loyal audience and consistently delivering valuable content are key to increasing your revenue potential on YouTube. Now, I'm no expert at this. I don't think anybody is actually an expert because from month to month, numbers, engagement, views, all of that changes video to video. Certain things trend, certain things fall off. But I truly would not be here without my beautiful babies, my audience, your views. Even if you're not subscribed to the channel, you're definitely contributing to the success of the channel just by being here. Your support and your engagement definitely helps to support the channel. And I personally want to say thank you all for being part of it. And I started my channel late in life. Most of the YouTubers that you see or content creators are young and starting lives, moving, doing all kinds of things to shake up the world. But I right now, I am a woman of a certain age. About my journey here, I'm not letting up. I don't mind being in the mix of everybody that's out there. It's a big platform. It's a lot of content creators out there, but there is always room for you. So I encourage you to pursue your own YouTube goals if that's exactly what you want to do. I can't say that it's easy. It is definitely work. And yes, many people are shocked to find out how much work you have to put into it, but even more shocked to know that you do get paid for it. It's just like anything on television. Ads run, you get paid. It's pretty simple when it comes to that, but it takes dedication, a passion, and also perseverance. Who wants to work and not get paid for it, okay? But that's how you have to start off. It's not immediate all the time. It takes a while. I will be answering any questions that you may have in regards to starting up a YouTube channel. Just hit me up in the comment section below. Thank you so much for taking time out to watch this video. I appreciate all of you all from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for hanging in here with me and more videos are to come. I will see y'all in the next video. Until then, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. Bye now.